right so i already have my foundation on i put that on before i start this video and i already did my eyebrows so i'm gonna start with the new product from beauty bakery cake face concealer and i got this in shade mug life and I love the packaging. I like the holographic lettering font that they got going on. I'm obsessed with that right now. Like, it's mesmerizing. It's, it's so satisfying. I'm gonna explain it. But I really love the packaging. As always, by them, cruelty free. It's expected to last up to 12 months. Let's open these. Oh, there's, they have baking tips on here too. Okay, there we go. Now, before we put this on, it says, this is a creamy full coverage liquid concealer. It is built with a waterproof formula and matte finish, providing all day wear, wear perfect for covering up imperfections and evening, evening out skin tone. And also some baking tips on here. And I love that, I love that about them because they're looking out for those who don't really know what they're doing like myself. Like I'm still new, I ain't new new, but I like to be refreshed with, you know, how to use something. Um, it says choose a shade lighter than your complexion. Yep, that's why I chose Mega Life. <laughs> Apply directly to clean skin with applicator wand. I already got foundation on. I don't do concealer before foundation. I just, it's not my cup of tea. But it was freshly washed before I put on the foundation. And blend quickly for a smooth and evening application. Okay, so by them saying that, I'm assuming that it's going to dry quickly. And from the some of the videos that I watched, like Jackie's, um, Jackie Hyena. I hope I'm saying her name right. Yes, it, it dries fast. So I only watched two videos, Jackie and Ashley. Wait, is it Ashley? I feel so bad. I don't watch her all the time. I think it's because the camera's on. Ow. Yeah, okay. Well, let's just finish the video. Y'all know who I'm talking about. And then top with flour setting powder to bake your cake face. Because I'm ready to get the cake face. I'm gonna mix it up. Again, cute packaging on here. It has the holographic font design. Cake face concealer. It's four ml is milliliters, right? Four milliliters, 14 ounces. <laughs> and on the bottom it has a little sticker, it says Mug Life. I think Mug Life was the lightest shade, so. My opinion, I hope eventually they get some more shade ranges, but I feel like they did a great job of making sure they had a equal amount of shades offered to the consumers. Like you have two light, or was it three? Three light shades, three medium shades, and was three dark shades. It was still a small amount, but the range was beautiful. It was great. So here it is. And since it dries fast, I think I'm just gonna do my under eyes first, and then go in with my beauty blender, and then do everything. Okay, I know what I'm doing. Okay. Gotta look in this mirror a little bit. And then, even then, it said it dried dries fast i'm moving pretty slow feels good it doesn't feel too thick it doesn't right now at least it doesn't feel sticky or anything it's not bad at all i think just because a lot of people like to go in do their whole face before blending is why people were having some trouble
So I guess just do a section at a time. Oh yeah, it dries fast because this side is a little harder to win. So maybe just do a section at a time. But the coverage is amazing. Like right before this came out, well, right before they announced that they were coming out with this, I was going to get the uh, Tarte Shape Tape. And then they came out with that foundation, the shade range was terrible, and I was like, mm, I ain't gonna get it. And then when this launched, I was like, yes, I'm gonna try this. And I love it. The only concealers I've ever used have been e.l.f., NYX, and my most recent one before this one, it was the, the Fenty Beauty Matchstick. And I loved it. I loved it. I just didn't like, because of the thickness of the concealer stick, um, I, I felt like it was just too thick, but then again, if it was too thin, it's going to break easy. So it was just like, oh, I hope she comes out with like a liquid form and then it would have been okay. And I think the coverage is, as far as coverage goes, is like the Fenty Beauty Match Stick, a little more coverage to it. But it's amazing. It's definitely amazing. And I dampened my beauty sponge. Or beauty blender. <laughs> oh, wow. So maybe those that are experiencing it being really sticky, tacky, or hard to blend, maybe dampen your blender your beauty blender because that was good i didn't have no problems all right let's do the nose It's not cakey, doesn't make me feel greasy, oily, or anything. Um, I'll be back. I'm gonna go put, um, get my contour. I'm gonna contour real quick and then I'm gonna come back and do the setting powder. All right, so I'm done contouring. Uh, yes, I am done. I'm done contouring and we're gonna go in with the setting powder. Now, let's see me this thing cute. Look at this. And then on here also has some baking tips. Can't really see it's a little blurry. Um, but it's a better not bitter setting powder. And I didn't know how this shade would look on me. Um, I normally use I've used the Fenty Beauty translucent blotting powder. I've used, um, dang it, what's the name of it? 
It's like an all orange. I'm really mad. I don't know what it is, and I've been using it all this time. I'll be back. I'm about to go get the name of it because I'm not really mad. Airspun. Airspun translucent full coverage is what I normally use. Oops, I just made a mess already. Oh, that's nifty. Let me read this package first. The baking tips. So cute! Oh my gosh. Okay, baking tips. Using a brush, you can lightly dust your entire face for a full matte look. With a gentle pressure, use a makeup sponge to apply the flour to your teasel to absorb excess oil. Excess oil? No, oh, I can't talk for nothing. You can tell. I scream, you scream. We all scream for brownies, gelato, lip whip ice cream and other sweets it's totes norms that tell someone sweet i like that i like that for a natural looking baked beet try our light way to much flour setting powder great for setting makeup and baking of course it even does like an ingredients right here like the label it stores oh. also expected to last about 12 months and it's got this little I don't know what it's called, but you can shut it so it doesn't spill when you're not using it. And I got the, what is this, in yellow? I got shade yellow. I've never tried a yellow. Like I said, I don't really need to with translucent. And I'm going to put this in the lid, actually. this type of sponge I find this is the best kind of sponge for me um, especially with this little I don't know what to call it this end right here for the nose and then getting it right there and making the perfect line right there with the contour and yeah so first I'm gonna go underneath the eyes good like the air spun it kind of smells like old lady no offense but it smells like a perfume my grandma's wear or something not my grandma's but a grandma I don't think mine really wears any yeah there we go For a little bit let it bake and oh I'm not doing a lot of eyeshadow but I'll do a little bit just to kind of like contour brow bone and everything and then we could get to then I'm gonna finish the rest of my makeup after I brush it off of course I'm gonna come back and then I'm gonna finish everything else and we'll get to the liquid but we're gonna see how this does look at this it's so cute are just so messy okay i'll be back okay guys i'm back put on mascara put on my lashes did a little bit of contouring on the eyeshadow popped a little shimmery stuff on top of the lid and we are gonna go ahead and brush this off now
love my airspun, but I really love this. This yellow tint is just going to be a pop of like a subtle yellow tint. Kind of brightens up the color just a tad. And I like it. But you know, we're going to wait till later to really be the judge of everything. But um, I'll be back. I'm going to finish up. I'm going to put some highlights, some blush, some bronzer. And then we'll be back to finish it up. Alright, and I'm finished with everything. Just need to get this lip whip on. Um, let's see, where to put it? I already did my lips, I already did my lip scrub, so no need to do that step. I already did that, did it after I brushed my teeth. But here is the packaging. And I got in the shade Ginger Snap. It is smudge free. It's expected to last up to 12 months as well. Look at this, the packaging is just so cute. It's just. Uh... Alright, so here it is. And it also came along with this Do's and Do Nuts Matte and Metallic Lip Whip. Do Nut Lip Liner. So it says lip whips are best worn alone and not in conjunction with any other product. If you decide to go for a lip liner, keep in mind that this product could affect the long wear of the lip whip. No, because with lighter, lighter shade, like if it's coming close to my complexion, then I'm gonna put a lip liner on, so good to know. Do not chapstick. Along with bones, Vaseline, Carmex, these are highly discouraged. If your goal is long wear, these products may have oils in them that break the lip whip down. Now, I've been using matte lipsticks or whatever it's for a while. Um, well, not for a while, probably past two years. I always used to use like a lip balm or Vaseline or something underneath, and I wondered why it didn't last very long. Good tip, good tip. Because I did not start using lip scrubs to put out the chapping and everything until this past summer, actually. Also says, do not smack the lips together. The lip whip is an ultra matte formula. Smacking or pressing the lips together is discouraged. We recommend allowing each layer a full 60 seconds to dry before applying the next. Do not apply more than three layers and keep the lips apart while applying. Good tip, because I always do all that. Do not eat oily foods, oil breaks, or formidable lip whips down. If met with oil, you will experience crumbling. Thank you, so make sure I don't eat my chicken. Do, do not forget to exfoliate. Exfoliating is important to smooth and soften, uh, soften dry or trapped lips. Applying an ultra matte lip whip on chapped lips will result in flaking. Whew. Do not forget to drink water. Water is the best way to achieve natural hydration of the lips. Otherwise, we have our sugar lip scrub to rescue your lips. I did not get that because I didn't know what flavor, if it had a scent or taste or anything to it. I like one with the taste to it because I just do. Do not forget to enjoy. The key thing about lip lips is that they give you back those moments that matter. You can kiss your baby or your man. You can eat, drink, or swim without worry. Free life proof lip lips. Okay. Let's see. Oh, I just took my lips. Alright. Oh, look at the applicator. What does mom like about them? drying I'm gonna fix my hair so that is it I will be back at the end of the day it's right now it's one o'clock I'm gonna see how it wears hey guys I am back oh my neck was crooked let me fix this real quick okay it is now it's 9 32 p.m. And I had I've had this on for eight and a half hours now. So 
guys i'm impressed there is no let me get in the mirror real quick i like it i love everything that i use from them in this video like usually i end up very oily um like i'm so like if i was going out tonight so sunday you can't really do much um except it is super uh super bowl today super do uh my tongue super bowl sunday today and i mean i ain't got nowhere to go but i really don't care about the super bowl and i don't know nobody who's throwing no party they got that nachos or pizza or whatever i should throw in that uh Super Bowl party next year. But that's besides the point. But, um, <laughs> the... Let's start with this. Because this is what I started off with first. Cake face. It's not cakey. But it gives you that cake look. Yes. I love it. I love it. I still love my Fenty Beauty. It's just like I said. It's, the, the stick is so thick that when it starts getting really, really round, it's like hard to get perfect lines when I'm trying to conceal like my nose or whatever like but everything else like my eyes um forehead and all that that's fine it's when I get my nose like I don't want it to be that thick you know of a line you know but um this is perfect I'm so glad that I passed the tart when I went with this because it's it's amazing um like I said it, earlier when I was applying it get a dampened sponge and do it in sections because it does dry unless you like it like that but <sighs> I like the dampened sponge okay and it did good I like it I love it I love it uh, I love it yes I'm gonna keep on buying this mug of life I hope you guys come up with a foundation eventually because uh your girl's here for it. I'm, I'm, I'm going to buy it. Let you know already. I'm going to buy it. Now, to the Beauty Bakery Better Not Bitter Flower Powder. I love this. I This was a... I didn't know what I was going to expect. Just because I've only dealt with translucent... Ugh, my tongue! Translucent powders <laughs> that were trans can't see okay it's translucent and with like I couldn't really do too much baking with my um air spun because it kind of give it a, a white cast a little bit so I can't bake I can leave it on for probably a good five minutes max and I need to get it off otherwise I'm gonna be pretty pale um still love it I love it I still love it just can't leave it on that long this I I see why everybody loves this like yes I want to keep buying this I love this I love this you guys I do I'm not and I'm not oily like it's been eight and a half hours and usually I start getting oily by the sixth hour sometime sooner but I'm not, I'm not oily at all. This, uh, let me fix my settings because it's like making it my forehead shiny. Okay, good enough, right there. Okay, so yes, I like it, I don't look it oily I don't it doesn't feel cakey at all when I applied it like, like in sections it was easy to apply just don't do everything and then try to go back so it it, it, it dries fast it really dries fast <laughs> but I love it I do I really 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 love it now on to this you know, I've eaten and everything while having this and your girl's lips are still popping with this ginger snap. For one, 
Oh, this color. I've been getting compliments all day with this color. Oh, yes. Oh, I love this. And I'm one of those people who just love mauve, mauve, mauve lippies. And this is me. Yeah, back to the lip whip. This color pop. Oh, so many compliments on this. Um, when I applied it, it was easy to apply, especially the applicator. I love the applicator. Hold on. I love the applicator. One, and I love that it lasts long. I ate, a t I ate two soft tacos with the sauce, the meats, the, the sour creams, everything. I had sour cream all on my face, wiped that off. <laughs> This ain't go nowhere. I've been licking my lips because I, I really, ooh, I wanted to put some uh, lip balm or something on, but I remember it said not to, so I licked my lips and I was good. And this ain't go nowhere. Still nothing. So it definitely lasts. It definitely lasts, and I love that. The only thing that I didn't like is shortly after I put it, well, not shortly after, from when I put it on, when you, your lips would touch, they would stick. It's not doing it now. When my lips would touch, they would stick. But I think after time, because I was looking at my lips, because I really wanted to put some lip balm on, because they felt like they were starting to get dry, it wore off. So now... It does not stick together so I really really love it it's just at the beginning it was kind of sticky but I don't care I love this color this color oh my mm, I love this color I love it okay let me, hurry, let me hurry and end this video so overall I loved all three products I'm definitely gonna go find some cute colors more shades and these lip whips and I'm definitely going to be buying, whoa, I'm definitely going to be buying the cake face again, the flower powder again when I run out, and I'm in love with Beauty Bakery. I am in love. My new Fenty Beauty and Beauty Bakery, I am here for it. Love it, 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 love it. I love it. So that was it for my video. I loved everything. If you have any questions about these products, um, I'm not really sure what I can answer, <laughs> but I mean, I will put the link down to Beauty Bakery below so you can check them out. They're great. They have great products. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, let me stop. I keep <laughs> I really love them so much. I am like, I am so, I'm definitely a returning customer, you guys. That's all I got to say. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell right next to it. Why are you not subscribed anyway? <laughs> Let me know down below what you think of this video and what you want to see next. Um, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.